Hello Davenport, I'm Julie Zerwitz, your Member of Parliament, and this is my Monday video for the week of April the 26th. It's a huge week, but before I go into it, I want to let you know, today I'm getting my very first vaccine shot. I am in a hot postal code, and so my turn has come up, and uh, I've been notified to get it later on this afternoon. So I'll let you know how it goes next week. Um, in the House of Commons, we have uh, lots of bills that are passing through, including C-12, which is a Net Zero Accountability Act, C-19, which is changes to the Election Act, and I will be speaking on it, so stay tuned for more information. C-22, which is um, criminal justice reform, and S-3, which is a Senate bill on offshore health and safety. In Davenport this week, we have a very special guest coming. We have the Honourable Patty Hyju, who's our Minister of Health, who will be joining us virtually at a Davenport Town Hall this uh, this uh, 20, uh, so April 28th, sorry, at 6 p.m. to 7 p.m. So if you haven't signed up yet, please do so uh, on my website. Just go to juliezerowitz.ca, click on the Davenport tab, and you'll sort of see a sub-tab that's events, and that's where you could sign up. Uh, in terms of vaccines, uh, about 30% of the Canadian population has received at least one dose. Uh, 14 million doses have actually been sent to provinces and territories and 12, sorry, 12, 14 million doses have been sent to provinces and territories and 12 million doses have actually been put into the arms of Canadians. So we're getting there and uh, starting in May, we're starting to get at least 2 million uh, Pfizer vaccines a week, which is really great. Uh, Janssen is starting to come in, which is the one dose uh, inoculation. And I know that uh, Minister Nita Anand is negotiating more AstraZeneca with the United States. So uh, soon we should be having far more than what we already have coming in. Uh, although I will say to you, Toronto continues to be a very worrisome situation. Our hospitals are full. Our ICU beds, beds are full, and I really encourage everyone to take extra, extra, uh, extraordinary steps to, to, to protect yourself. Uh, please make sure to, uh, to wear a mask. Uh, please make sure to keep your distance, wash your hands, and stay home as much as possible. If there's anything my team and I can do to, to help you, please call, call our office at 416-654-8048. Uh, my team and I are here to serve you. It's an honor and a pleasure. Please keep safe and uh, look forward to uh, speaking with you next week.